What's up guys, Piper here, bringing you a video today, we're doing some Battle of Gilnea's action. In this video today I want to talk about a topic, but first, what I want to talk about is a sexy panther that I got like 20 minutes ago. I just, uh, I've been running ZG probably, well I mean, been, been running the new ZG, the heroic ZG version, for about, uh, maybe 4 months, I'm gonna guess 4 months, it's probably been longer to be honest, but I can say, only these bots, look at these bots, I don't really want to go in there and be one of those bots to be honest. Let's let them run past, and then we're gonna just sneak on by because all those bots right right there, as you see, we're gonna go mines. And I don't want to stop and fight a billion bots by myself. So instead, what I'm gonna do is come in for the druid. Gonna put a flare down right there. Flareon, flare catastrophe, flare goodness. Gonna disengage. I actually preemptively disengaged a little bit. Gonna put a bunch of down. It's a boomkin. Gonna sound some right there and start doing some work. They've yeah, been doing that. Um, been doing that work. Uh, been doing ZG for so long. And I start. I was almost gonna not do it anymore. Like it was to the point where I was just like, no, nah, no, nah. doing ZG for so long. But I've kept at it every day, man, for about four months. Just got it, and honestly, I honestly think it paid off because I love fucking Panthers in this game. I love the way they look. They look fantastic. Look at that shit. Look at that shit. I mean, it could use a bit of a texture quality upgrade, but I don't, I don't care. I don't give a shit. When you're running around on the Panther, you look badass. But uh, what I want to talk about in this video today, besides more people coming down to kill me and I'm by myself. Oh, I'll get some backup coming over. Look at that. Oh my god, look at all the backup coming over here. What I want to talk about is, I recently came to kind of a realization that you guys are amazing. Um, I've been watching a lot of other YouTubers recently, trying to find, and by the way, if you guys know a lot of, uh, like, smaller YouTube WoW channels, I've, I've been trying to find some to try and, like, find them and watch their videos and support them and stuff like that. And it's, it's hard, man. It's hard to find people with small YouTube channels. I mean, I have it. My YouTube channel is small, but you know what I mean. You you know what I mean when I say small YouTube channels. I'm trying to find them, trying to help them out and see if I can help some people get some more viewers and stuff like that. But, um, basically, I've, because I've been looking at other people's YouTube channels a lot, I'm starting to realize that the YouTube community as a whole is shit. Like, there's a lot of, like, hatred going around, people hating on people, and there's a lot of fucking... There's just a lot of angry motherfuckers in the world, and there's, and there's a lot of hate going on. I'm leaving the flag as well, by the way, guys. I, I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna sit around and wait for PvP. Actually, I'm gonna just go camp the graveyard. Fuck it. Fuck it. Camp and graveyard. Engage. We lost mines, but I don't care. Popping, a, popping my map up the moment I see an alliance. Probably not a good idea. But basically, because I've been looking at other people's YouTube channels and seeing all this hatred, I'm like, man... Why do I not... Why, somehow I excluded myself from this demographic. Somehow I managed to not get any of this hate onto my YouTube channel. I've gotten it on WoW before. Like, I've gotten a few people that have, like, you know, hated on me in WoW because of the way I play or something. And, and it's never bothered me in my entire life. It's never it's never been a... Like, I, I expect it, you know what I mean? I think I've talked about it in a few videos before where it's like, I expect to get hate. And I, I am completely okay with that. And I expect it. Because of I, I expect it, I'm like, okay, you know, when it happens, I'm like, oh, whatever. I just, usually I laugh about it, to be honest. I laugh about it with Kate a lot. Um, but I, I realize that my community of, like, people that watch my YouTube channel and you guys who are watching this right now, for some reason, is, like, a thousand times better than any other people's communities. I don't understand how that's a thing. I'm just killing the same DK over and over again. I'm going to leave after the kill this time. I'm going to find someone else to kill. Jesus Christ. Um, and I, I don't know, understand how I've gotten such an awesome, like, group of people to watch my video. I honestly, like, I also, I honestly mean, like, the most awesome I could, I could find out of all, all YouTube, YouTubers, all fucking communities out there. Everyone in my, who's a subscriber to me that watches my stream, especially that watches my stream. You're, you're just amazingly awesome people that fucking are genuinely nice and just want to have some fun and fucking watch some YouTube and play some WoW, you know what I mean? And it's weird that I somehow managed to find that group of people but all these other people having like a bunch of hate and i don't know i don't know how i managed it i hopefully i'm not jinxing myself but uh yeah it's amazing to me man it's honestly amazing to me how i uh managed to uh find all you awesome people and like not get many of the many of the cunts for lack of a better word um well actually that's probably the best word to use for it cunts is amazing oh my god it's, it's pretty it's pretty descriptive it's pretty i know it's offensive but it's not really i'm australian keep that in mind i am in fact australian and that is a word that we use quite often. That Red Paladin is an undead motherfucker with wings, but he's gonna die anyway. Try to turn around and go for me. Not a good idea. You don't want to go for the big torn with a giant bow. That's not a thing you want to verse. Could you imagine running into this guy? Imagine, imagine running into this. Some fucking giant cow riding a panther. I mean, it's just, it's death on legs. You're not, it's not fun. You're dead. You're just dead. There's no, there's no coming back from that. 
This is worse than Slenderman. People are scared of Slenderman. Look at this. I'm in, well, for some reason I'm like invisible right now, but Jesus, look at that shit. With a bird army, with a burnt cake bird army in one line for some reason. Good lord. That's scary as fuck. I'm going to destroy everything. I destroy like doorways just walking through them. It's fucking nuts. It actually, that actually would really be scary. Could you imagine this? <laughs> I would never want to face go face to face with this in real life. It would scare the shit out of me. But anyway, so I wanted to say thanks to you guys. I kind of I kind of didn't realize when I made that 9k sub video a while ago. Um, I didn't realize like what 9k subscribers were. I've had it in my head that I want 10k for so long that I've just been working towards it and working towards it. Um, that I didn't actually stop to think like, man, you hit 9k subscribers. Like I didn't stop to be like, man, you that's a giant milestone that you should be happy about. All I, all I honestly all I thought was like, almost there, man. You're almost at 10k. You're almost at your goal. And I kind of I think about that a lot for a lot of things, guys. Like when I set a goal for myself that I really want to hit, even the my milestones along the way, a lot of times I forget about how major they are. Um, but I recently, I don't know if someone said something in stream that made me think of this, but someone, someone said something, I forget who it was, and they, um, it just for some reason sunk down, like, sunk, it got, in, it got into my head, and I was like, man, there, you're like 9,000 people, that's a shitload of fucking people, you're, you're 100% correct, so that's crazy amounts of people. Not to mention, like, you guys watch most of my fucking videos, like, I get, I get super worried when I upload stuff that isn't just my normal WoW Hunter content, because that's, that's what my channel's known for, is WoW Hunter content. So naturally, and by the way, fuck tanks and BGs. Who's fucking? I'm a fucking guardian druid with over a million health. I'm gonna go do a BG. How about you go suck a dick instead of doing a BG? How about you do that? Jesus Christ! Fuck me. He's gonna beat on our whole team is beating on one druid for seven years because that's fucking quality. That's fun. That's fun, Blizzard. Don't change that. Jesus Christ! Actually, I think they are changing in Warlord, so hopefully it stops being such a fucking pain in my ass. But um. Yeah, so I, I, that sunk in, I thought about 9k subscribers, and like, man, it's crazy, and it's crazy even that like, it, everything goes, everything snowballs, everything for some reason snowballs, and like, it does spike sometimes, like for instance, around 5k subscribers, I got a huge spike and hit 6k in like a couple days, like I got a thousand subscribers really quick, um, and then it, it slowed back down, and then it spikes, and it slows back down, but the overall average of subscribers I gain actually goes up, which is crazy to me, because it's like, I already have... 9,000 people who watch my stuff. How am I finding more people to, to watch my... You know what I mean? It's like... Or am I ever going to run out of new people to watch and find my stuff? It seems like... I guess there's a shitload of people in the world, but I just didn't think there would be that many that were would be interested in watching me fuck around in PvP and shit. As well as I have to mention... I have to mention this, guys. I've been streaming a lot recently, and it's come to my attention pretty much... It's pretty much been forced upon me. It'd be, it'd be impossible for me not to realize... How fucking awesome you guys are in stream! Like you guys are amazing when I stream. Quality conversations. You're always you're all like laid back. I don't. I've never had to mod ban someone from chat. I never had to give anyone a timeout or some bullshit. My stream chat is just. It's the same as YouTube. It's, I just somehow managed to get an amazing amount of quality people to watch my stuff. Um, and that's also led to a lot of uh, quality people deciding that they wanted to donate to me. Someone I have to give a fucking shout out to is Weekly Super. Weekly Super dropping fucking dollars on me. It seems like nearly every fucking, I'm not gonna lie, it seems like nearly every day I'll jump on stream and Weekly's donated some, some form of money and it's like, Jesus, like today, today I was on stream for about, uh, four or five hours and I mentioned that I was hungry. So Weekly d donates to me some money to buy a pizza. Like that's... Just, it's stuff that, like, maybe to even to Weekly or maybe other people in stream, they think, oh, that's nice of him, but they don't think that big of a deal of it. It's just a pizza. But to me, it's like, it's crazy that some guy that I've never met in person, I've never had the, you know, the opportunity to meet and, like, enjoy his company, uh, would, like, think that I'm good enough of a person or like me enough to even want to do that for me is ridiculous. It's, the fact that that's a thing that can happen, it's crazy to me. It's crazy that someone like that would, so, have, like, have high regards for me in any way. In any way, that to me, is, is crazy. And I just wanted to say thanks to you guys. Not, and it's not just weekly. I've been I've been donated to by a lot of people, and it's like Jesus. I just I just never expected to get this much support. Like I I kind of like I hope to get the viewers and I hope to get subscribers and I hope to get people to watch my my, my channel and subscribe and help me make this into a, a job instead of just a hobby. But I, what I didn't expect, what I didn't even bother to hope for was having an amazing group of people that actually did that for me and supported me. Like, not only are you guys subscribing and watching, but you're fucking being extremely nice, you're extremely supportive, you're always writing nice comments and supporting me, and I just never thought that would be a thing. I, I honestly thought when I made YouTube, YouTube equals you get views, 
but you get trolled and you get bullied and you get fucking ch shit talked in your comments and I honestly thought that's what it was I knew that going in so I was like man at least I have, I have thick skin I'll be able to deal with that no problem which it's it's the truth if I did have that I probably would be able to deal with it no problem but I haven't had to deal with it whatsoever which is it's nuts to me it's nuts that you guys are so fucking loving and supportive of just what I fucking do it's, it's crazy and I have to say a big thanks to you guys as well for basically liking the, the shorter videos I've, I've been putting out I've been putting out like like you know 30 to second to four minute videos of me just kind of fucking around on WoW and just like having a, having a decent time just kind of I've kind of started feeling what I do when I'm not actually usually recording I'll record a little bit and I might edit edit together or I'll do some machinimas and stuff like that and you guys seem to actually like those a lot like they actually some of those are getting more views than my uh my actual WoW content my WoW Hunter content so naturally because of that I'm gonna keep making those videos every time I think of an idea or if I'm just going out and like chilling out and shit like that I'll naturally record it for you guys and upload it as long as it passes my own standards uh, like there's a very there's, there's some things that I won't upload depending on the way they work like if there's bad audio quality quality if Steve for instance is crying too much in a video Steve cries a lot Steve for some reason does not like it when I speak to myself uh, and by the way I'm starting to lose my fucking voice here I've been I've been talking all day on stream um, if I um, if I start talking to myself and like recording a video Steve for some reason hates that um, and he, he will often he will often at times come and just sit right next to me and cry while I record a video. And naturally, because I, I cannot have a video of just Steve crying, I'll scrap that one and delete it, and I'll start over and might just go chuck Steve outside or some some something like that. But uh, but if it passes my my you know my quality and my quality testing and what I think is good enough to upload to my channel, it seems like you guys completely agree and you support me 100%. I just want to say a huge thank you to get, to you guys and just thanks so much for supporting me. I hope you continue to support me and I hopefully I'll be able to bring you the same you know awesome wow content and hopefully i'll be able to think of some new ideas if you guys have anything that you think i should do in wow any uh videos you think i should make or anything you want to see me doing wow put it in the comment section below and i will try my bestest my bestest to get it done for you guys and by the way i have recently been adding people to my friends list because i um i've been bg'ing with a lot of people and of course because we're streaming a lot we'll actually bg in the streams with uh with the viewers so i've been giving out my um my b tag to people so if you want to add me to b tag guys let me open up for you I actually cannot open to it. It's Pipo6825. If you cannot remember that, go to my stream and look in the rules, and you'll have you'll see my B tag and Kate's B tag. You're gonna add us, and we can play together sometime, and hopefully have a good time. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Have a good time with you. I hope to see you in the next video. And I'll see you later, guys. See you later.